Samuel A. Turnkey, Herman J. Valdrini, Alfred L. Warren. Dozens gathered for the 72nd commemoration of the deadly 1946 plane crash that killed 25 servicemen. The men were returning home from World War II before their B-17 plane crashed into Mount Tom just minutes from Westover. Mount Tom was transformed from a place of tragedy and loss to a place of a community coming together to honor her lost brother and the other 25 guys. The monument was created in 1996. I've been coming here since 1995, the year before the memorial was built. Rocks and plane debris found by hikers memorialized the site. I kept a piece of molten aluminum from the plane crash on my desk at uh, Veterans Services in Northampton. And quite often I would squeeze the, uh, kind of squeeze it in my hand and say, Come on, Cal, you got to get going. You got to get this project done. U.S. Coast Guard Alfred Warm's family has been visiting the site that claimed their uncle for decades. This place meant more to my mother than any place on the earth, and my mother meant more to me than any person on this earth. We knew that it was her final weeks, and it would be her last time up here on the mountain. Right in front of that stone, we were married 10 years ago. In a moment of recognition and healing, a B-17 performed a tribute flyover. So it was uh, definitely an honor, very um, emotional and strong thing to do, and uh, we hope that the people on the ground that attended the ceremony had a good view of the aircraft, the type that did crash there. This year was the first time the commemoration ceremony and Westover Air Show was held at the same time. Reporting live in Holyoke on top of Mount Tom, to Shawnee Whitlow, 22 News.